this year we would like to have a call completed on uh, um, multidimensional international ranking stemming from Europe and from European perspective, which means taking into account research performance, but also teaching and social conditions at our universities in order to, to map the situation and to help students, parents, teachers, professors, researchers to orient better in the world of education and to make more informed, better informed decisions. First time that's appeared, um, and many are worried that that will be interpreted by ministries as a call. In the next years, 10 years namely, we would like to see uh, the implementation of the measures already agreed, strengthened, and in particular, I would like to call upon ministers to agree to target more on mobility and to increase the level of uh, international mobility in Europe to 20% by 2020. Today, uh, we see uh, we are somewhere at the half of this level. Misinterpretation of Bologna or not proper understanding of Bologna process in some corners of Europe. So what we need is knowledge, clarification, participation. That's why I think that the role of universities, but also students in the Bologna process is indispensable. Educational reforms need some time and consensus. So when ministers or administrations are changing rapidly or changing the, the reforms themselves, then how to get fruits? We need some sustained efforts in order to achieve results. And that's an, another rather political problem, sustainability of reforms.